Welcome everybody to this first Xbox recorded game on the channel Flexo013. I'm currently here all by myself, uh, no darkness, no Taka, and um, we're playing some plans for z zombies. So, um, first, uh, if you don't know what this game is, it's a lot of fun. That's, that's what I could say for sure. Um, what the... Uh, Goal of the game is, is to protect your house or your garden from the zombies. As you can see, the zombies are on the right. You have, some of them have uh, traffic cones on their head. And they are quite sturdy in comparison to the other uh, zombies. So, okay. Um, let's get um, uh, some nice stuff going on here I have no clue what I should pick we're good we're doing some survival over here so we're, we're going to play until we die and um, I probably get to repick every once in a while I actually am going for some melon bolts as well okay so uh, ready set plant okay so the game starts up pretty pretty slow it's raining sunshine, and you just plant more plants. The sunshine, the sunflowers produce sunshine, and the sunshine is pretty much your money in this game. The more sun, uh, sun uh, like as you can see, uh, for one sunflower it costs me uh, fifty uh, sunshine. And on all the other ones, like for the repeater, it is 200. For the bee shooter, it's 100. And every single one has their own prize. And this is pretty much how you can tell um, how much your thing will cost. Over here, I have two upgrade cards. This is the double sunflower and the repeater. I can uh, use those upgrades on uh, either the... Uh, sunflowers to make them produce twice as much sunshine but uh, let's not do that for now on the bottom right you can see the level progress and it will go very slow at the start but it will speed up over time so um, actually want to get some more sunflowers going on here but it seems that we need to defend us ourselves against the next zombie. So yeah, you have these kernel pulls, they throw small kernels of butter. And if they throw a big lump of butter, it will take out or it will slow them down, as you can see. They cannot move anymore when they're hit by the butter. So let's um, quickly go over the strategy we're going uh, with. And uh, like uh, two rows of sunflowers that will give me 10 sunflowers uh, of sun production. That should be a pretty good start. And uh, actually, I'm using this upgrade as fast as possible because it's quite expensive. Okay, I'm slowing this one down because he is a little bit getting too close to my plans. I hope this one will make it. Otherwise we'll... Yeah, there we go, there we go. Don't lose it. Okay. So, uh, oh no, oh no, oh no. No! My plant! No, I have to... I have to, like... Okay. Fix. There we go. So, quickly reinforce that so the zombies will come with more and more and more and I should not they want to eat my brains and I live inside the house so I don't I want to protect my house uh, let's see um, I think we have some pretty decent base defense on every single lane right now um, I'm actually going to switch to watermelons because those deal splash damage, which is quite convenient. Um, let's 
see, we have enough sunflowers, we don't need any more. Okay, so a huge wave of zombie, that's pretty much the end of the first day, as I guess you could call it. It doesn't become nighttime or anything after that. It's just like that's when you get to repick your plants. So I plan on making uh, winter melons of these and just just freezing the heck out of them, yeah. putting a lot of damage in there, like full out of salt on there. So as you can see, more zombies are approaching, and um, let's quickly uh, get, grab some new plants. We already have enough sunflowers, we don't need any more of these. Those we still need the uh, upgrade, we need the uh, watermelon pulp, the winter melon. Um, it's always nice to have some kernel pulps. And a few cop uh, a few of those. I'm actually going to do this a little bit different than I normally do. Just for the heck of it. Uh, so if I use a coffee bean and a mushroom together, then the mushroom wake up, wakes up. Mushrooms are usually for nighttime. Oh no, wait, let's not do that. Well, since we'll... Pro if you guys like this, uh, we will probably make a second episode where we try a different one and then we might speed up a little bit we might speed not oh i have no clue what i should pick uh, oh, let's just go with uh oh, i have no clue what i'm doing here mm, let's uh quickly grab an imitator of that and do it just for the heck of it there we go Start the game. So, okay, the sunflower upgrade is still recharging. I'm going to defend. Oh, look, bucket, bucket zombies. Those bucket zombies are quite the sturdy zombies. But luckily, I have a watermelon pole on that one. So it should be good. Sunflower is done. Let's wait for some sun, and there we go, sunshine. Sunshine. Okay, no, no, no. Let's just not sing that song. Um, and so, uh, base defense. Everything seems to be alright. Eventually, there will be a point where they will probably start murdering me. But hey, that's life. No, you don't. You don't just try to fault over my whatever it is. Hmm, we might need some more defenses, defenses on the middle lane. Yeah, let's 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 just quickly try to grab. Need one more sun. Dang it! Dang it! Our wall, our tallness will. Oh no, wait, it's a wall. So these tiny little boogers are walnuts, and their upgraded version are walnuts. Which also prevent people from leaping over. And all the nice stuff. Okay, um. Oh, I'm just saying this. I'm going to make a mechanism that will make sure that buckets and other objects that uh, zombies use will be taken away from them so they have less of an advantage. Although the thingy has a recharge and doesn't go through instantly. But hey, be here. So as you can see the winter melon pulps uh, are freezing quite a lot of zombies means that we're going good. Okay, another sunflower upgrade. So this is just my basic strategy for... And... That was a flag? Oh. 
Oh, we seem to be doing pretty good. We still need the uh, sunflower upgrade on the winter melon and the watermelon. And... Ooh, so there will be boogie zombies. I don't like those. Um, so we need this one and this one. And, uh, there we go. Let's quickly grab the imitator pumpkin. Um, I don't know. Let's grab these two again. So eventually, uh, I have no clue what I'm doing. Here. Um, let's just grab I don't know uh, jalapeno and a squash. Just for the heck of it. The game of this, the sound of this game is just awesome. Music wise and everything, it's just relaxing, but at the same time, it's a fun game to play and just to smash the heck out of it. Go a little bit more upgrades. So. I'm not sure that this will be as entertaining to watch for you the entire fucking time. Maybe I'll just fast forward a little bit until I'm in more interesting waves. I don't know when that will that when that will happen. But, uh, we'll resume the recording uh, sometime when we are like, Oh my god! Zombies everywhere! Right now, walls keeping them off right well. Anyway. Uh, I need something to talk about, dang it. Um, let's talk about the boogie zombie that is trying to eat my uh, mushroom. Screw you, boogie zombie. Get splattered. Huge wave of zombies. Okay, so this might be the actual tiny interesting part of this entire wave. Uh, boogie zombie. Okay, let's quickly use a jalapeno. Just because we can. Boom, and all the zombies on the other plane are completely murdered. I need one more upgrade, but the recharge isn't fast enough. Dang it. Okay, so uh, I guess more winter melons or something. Yay! Let's. Okay, so rugby zombie level. Ah, uh, I know. Um, I'm going to use a lot of those. Still going for the upgrades. Let's put some spike rock down there. I have mm, watermelon. That's also a nice one. Um. Let's see. Uh, these two for repairs. Let's see. No, I wanted the uh, pumpkin. There we go. Okay, so uh, we're setting up some spikes there. Just for future waves, possibly. When we are like, ah, oh, we could use it. I don't know when that will be, but there will probably be a moment when spikes are very useful. So we're setting those up. Okay, now our sunflower sun production is steady. I guess that's a that's a good thing. All these spike rocks do a little bit of extra damage. Okay, another mushroom active. Just to Take out the uh, rocky zombies that should be appearing any second. Uh, some more spike rock over here. Uh, quite the slaughter going on. But our defenses are, are well set up. I 
going for an upgrade is really so we don't need any spike weed anymore so we have all of that I don't know I feel like replacing this guy with another colored one there we go Mercury zombie is easy without his helmet easy peasy okay let's do this and that was I find it slightly disappointing. Only slightly. Okay. So, uh, screen doors. Yay. Magnet rooms will really come in handy over here. Um, what else should we add into? Oh, we're just going to put these in. I don't know, jalapeno might be nice. I don't need a cactus, I need a squash. Or a cherry bomb. Um, did I forget something? Did I forget something? I don't believe I did. Oh, I couldn't get my mushroom again. So, something like that. Okay, already is that bland. Okay, that's quite a nice start. Sun. Shine shines. So I am not sure if those winter melons that I'm making, the winter melon pulse thingy, actually do more damage. Because otherwise I should focus on making more watermelons first, and after that I should try and focus on upgrading them. But hey, who cares? I need a little bit more sun. I thought the sun collection was going to be sufficient for a lot. Friendly it is. Well, at least my mushrooms, my mechanist rooms are very busy. That's it. Grabbing all the items. Okay, so uh, let's talk about, uh, I don't know, uh, some more items. So yeah, leave in the comments, uh, that's actually a good thing to, to talk about. Uh, in the comments you should leave your suggestions about other games, or your opinion on what you, if you like Plants vs Zombie videos, or what I should change about them. Pretty much just give your opinion. Like, I want to know what you guys want to see, how do you want to see, do you want me to see me yeah, playing? this game half an hour or do you want to only want to see the huge zombie waves every single day or do you only want to see me die wait did we just complete it i believe we did yes we did wow then uh, this is the end of the first video oh that's surprisingly fast so i guess this was a uh, episode one survival day next episode we'll do a uh, survival night if you guys like it so, uh, leave a like if you want to see more Plants vs. Zombies. Favorite if you are like, Plants vs. Zombies is the most awesome game I've ever, ever seen. I, I need to do ah! then, then, drop, drop a favorite. Very much appreciate it. Share it with your friends. Or don't. No, no, really. Actually, do. Because that helps us out. And, um, of course, check our Facebook, Twitter. Links are in the description. And, um, I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye. And we have golems. Yes. And I mean, this is like the end result that, like, oh, that's just, that's the most satisfying sound.